Here are five improvements made from Breath of the Wild to Tears of the Kingdom. First up is the fact that if you have a full inventory while opening a chest, you can easily drop a weapon right then and there, which was so neat in Breath of the Wild. Next, you can actually use your scope while using your paraglider. I'm not sure why this wasn't in Breath of the Wild, but it's nice to have it here. Next is the cookbook that you can look through once you created a dish. This can help you if you simply forgot what you worked on before. Stables now have a point system that rewards you for finding and using them. With this system, you can unlock some pretty cool stuff. Weapon durability was very controversial in Breath of the Wild, but Tears of the Kingdom improves the weapon durability with the introduction of Fuse. Sure, weapons still break, but it's not as bad as it was before. And last, we have Pro Mode. Now, Pro Mode was introduced in Breath of the Wild, which only gave you hearts to look at. But in Tears of the Kingdom, not only are the map and the rest of the HUD gone, but also the hearts too, so you get this beautiful shot of everything. 